I would like to start by recognizing our hosts, PASCOM and the UPCM COMI unit. I would also like to recognize the presence of the National Director of APMC, Dr. Ramon Arcadio, the Unit Head of the UPCM COME, Dr. Lia Palileo Villanueva, the PASCOM officers headed by the dynamic Dr. Cherry Bernardo Lazaro, PASCOM PAS Presidents, Dr. Georgina Paredes, Dr. Ramon Paterno, Dr. Carolina Tapia, and Dr. Edelina de la Paz. Our fourth, Dr. Fernando S. Sanchez Jr. Memorial Lecturer, Dr. Elizabeth Paterno. Deans, faculty, residents, students, ladies and gentlemen, good morning. It is with honor and gratefulness that I speak to you in behalf of our family today. As I listened to Dr. Paterno's speech, I reflected on my own training. And I agree that our curriculum then was lacking in terms of preparing us for our community immersion. But whatever lack that cur curriculum had was more than made up for by the active roles of our faculty and mentors, particularly by Dr. Portia Marcelo and the late Dr. Noel Huban. I think their mentoring was what endeared us to community medicine. And I see that the passion is carried out by so many of you. But passion can only take us so far. And to empower communities in terms of healthcare as the goal is a very tall order for any one college or organization for that matter. Together, PASCOM, the APMC, and the different colleges can begin to embark on this monumental task by strengthening the curriculum community medicine curriculum, and continuing to inspire the medical students. Though I tend to think that the scope is well beyond just medical school. I think this well encompasses allied and paramedical courses, as well as social work courses, and ultimately work on the ground for the most important stakeholder, which is the community. My father often talked about primary health care. He did not care for medical missions. It was his dream that every community would be served by a primary care physician. Though this may not be realized in the very near future, your continued efforts will slowly and surely yield its fruits. Congratulations, Dr. Paterno, on your lecture. Thank you for raising some of the issues on the needs and wants, as well as possible solutions to improving training in community medicine. It is with discussions such as this that we can hope to improve and better our system. Thank you and congratulations to the organizing committee on coming up with this four-day course. And thank you for inviting our family to participate. Maraming salamat po at mabuhay.